In today's Talk of the Town, it is estimated 80% of New Year's resolutions fail by February. If you're one of the many not meeting your, your, your nutritional goals, if I can even say it, you might be able to reach them a new way. Larray Robinson is a nutrition consultant with Alive Again. What's your advice? Well, whenever we get to January, it's you always hear New Year, New You. Right. But I really encourage folks that I personally don't believe in diets. I believe they bring you into bondage, they make you obsessed with food. And it is my opinion that if your focus is good health, the weight will fall in line and everything else will fall in line. It'll take time, but you've got to focus on health. And instead and of looking wait. at the entire year, like saying, I'm going to set this New Year's goal, you know, for all of the year, you're saying, let's take it one month at a time, That's even right. one week at a time. That's right. You know, I, I encourage folks to set realistic goals. It's got to be realistic. It's got to be sustainable. So before you embark on any way of eating, you have to ask yourself, can I eat like this for the rest of my life? And if the, if the answer is no, you've got to run from it, whatever it is. But break it down. You know, one week encourage your children or your family to eat more fruit. Like fruits and vegetables. That's right. That you have if you're not drinking enough dish. water, set a, set a goal for yourself to drink more water. Mm -hmm. If you know you are, you know, drinking too many sodas, why not replace one of your sodas with seltzer water mm -hmm. and some ice and lemon in a restaurant? So, you know, just take small steps because when you lay a foundation and, and, and you, you set a goal and you get it right, you can build on that foundation. This month's recipe that you're highlighting is this nut and seed yes. granola type dish. Yes, it's a, and what have you done with it here? So I love this because it takes 20 minutes. We do a, a batch every Sunday and it's so versatile. You can use it as a snack before sport. You can do it over fruit salad for brunch with some yogurt. And then you can do it over a salad instead of cranberries that are full of sugar and many of them have sulfur dioxide in you can just sprinkle that over and it's got all the good fats and all the natural sugars with, with, with within the nuts and I have this recipe in my possession now it's going to be on my Facebook page later today and in the meantime if you'd like to take a class at Larray's barn which is in Irmo the next one is going to be Tuesday March 3rd from 630 to 830 in the evening the plant-based vegan meals course will be at 232 Bookman Mill Road sign up at alive again online online.com. Mm -hmm. Lorraine, thank you. It's such a pleasure. Thank, thank you, you Dondi. We'll be right back.